Hey there, this is your friend Octopus, and today I'm going to show you how to and where to get your level 20 apprentice riding mount, your very first mount in the game of WoW. Alright, uh, so if you're ready, we're going to go ahead and start off an alliance, because you can see I'm the storm wind, and I'll go through each playable race. Uh, you can go ahead and skip to the one you want in the next screen here. And here you can click on your race to go exactly to the point in the video where your race is featured and see just where and who to get your mount from. Alright, so here is the human spot for picking up your mount. Uh, this is actually Eastvale Logging Camp in Elwyn Forest. So we'll come down here and you can see this uh, is our guy right here for apprentice riding. You can learn your level 20 riding skill from him here and next we've got uh, this lady right here who will sell you a horse mount if you are exalted with stormwind or a human uh, at level 20 and now let's take a look at the other mounts here we've actually got ourselves a nice horse there a very nice uh, brown horse here and we've also got over here in the stables a chestnut mare very nice very nice And you can see that uh, this is all actually in Elwyn Forest. Eastfell Log Camp specifically. You can fly there. You can walk from Stormwind uh, past the Tower of Azora and over the river. It's right there. Here in the wetlands, you can actually buy yourself uh, a black stallion. This is Meadowfield Harbor in the wetland. You can fly there. Uh, there's a black stallion, as you can see here. Most people think it's uh, not in the game anymore or. Uh, that is a rare mount. It's really not. It's another one of the racial mounts. Uh, and you can only get it here though. However, from Unger Stratforth. Here we've got the Night Elf mounts. Uh, these are actually Saber mounts. Pretty neat. Uh, one of my favorites here. Uh, you can see this lady will sell you the mounts if you are a Night Elf or exalted with Darnassus. And he will sell you uh, apprentice riding skills. Now let's take a look at these um, saber mounts over here. You can see we've got this uh, sort of spotted one here, and a couple of striped ones, like a black striped one. We've got an orange shorter striped one, and a lighter colored white striped one. They're very nice. And they look even greater when you're riding them. <laughs> I love them. Uh, you can see here on the map that it's right here in the Cenarian Enclave in Darnassus, uh, next to the Howling Oak. Also in Darnassus are the uh, Worgen's mounts, uh, the mountain horse, of which there's only one variation. You find this at the Howling Oak, uh, right next to the Enclave, and uh, it's it's an alright horse, I guess. <laughs> Take a look at it for yourself, judge it for yourself. Um, but if you're a Worgen, you can also get the Running Wild ability at level 20, which is probably superior in that mountain horse, which lets you run at the speed of a ground mount. Very nice, interesting, uh, sort of. Uh, Morgan trait here. Over in Karanos, uh, we've got ourselves the Dwarven uh, mount seller, and this guy will actually sell you rams. Uh, this is the ram breeder right here that will sell you rams if you're a dwarf or exalted with Iron Forge, and this is the skill trainer here for riding. Let's take a look at the rams here. We've got ourselves a very nice uh, white riding ram. Which actually says mount in the name, interestingly enough, even though none of the other mounts do. Here's a brown ram. I like this one a lot. What we've got here a gray ram. Simple, straightforward. It looks like a like a mountain ram indeed. And that's actually all the mounts uh, for the dwarves. You can see this is uh, by the Amber Steel Ranch, just outside of Iron Forge, if you take the road all the way down. And nearby in Karanos, uh, we've got ourselves uh, the Gnome Trainers and the Gnome Meccano Strider Sellers. That's the name of the mount there, the Meccano Strider. Uh, it's very nice. Sold by these two gnomes here. This one will sell you the, the riding skill, and this one will sell you the Meccano Strider itself. If you are a gnome or exalted with Gnome Aragon. Um, Hi, how are you? There you go, you can see Apprentice Riding, approximately 4 gold. And the Meconostrider Merchant. These Meconostriders here come in varieties of 
orange, like a red orange sort of color. Got yourself a green color, a um, blue color here as well, which is very nice. I love the look of the blue one here. You've also got yourself a regular unpainted gray one. Take a close up on these guys here. You can see that this is in Karanos, just outside of it. Next sign, Forge. Next up, we've got the Elex, sold by our friends the Draenei from Burning Crusade. This is the apprentice riding trainer, and this is the seller if you are a Draenei or exalted with Exodar. Here are the Elex, the plain regular Elex here. Just sort of a tannish color, like a regular uh, elephant almost. You've got yourself a green elect here. A uh, nice little uh, regular shade of green. Kind of the same as the last one. You've got ourselves a blue elect of sorts. Maybe a gray elect almost. And we've also got ourselves a purple elect, my favorite elect. Very interesting coloration for an elephant. You can see that this is all actually. Uh, just outside of the X-Dar here, I'll open the map in a second. This is just, you take uh, the Griffin Master uh, right here and go all the way up and out. I'll zoom out here and you can see we actually are just outside of the X-Dar. Here we have the Pandaren Mouth for the Alliance, which can be found in Stormwind. They are found at the Pandaren community nearby just under uh, the balloon here. It's a large red Chinese style or should I say Pandaren style balloon at this island up here next to the lake. I'll take a look at this balloon so you can see what it looks like. You see from the topmost building. Uh, and so let's get a closer look here. She will give you your riding skill training for four, four gold approximately. And the gentleman right next to her will give you your mount if you are a pandaren or exalted with uh, <laughs> whoever it is the pandaren are represented by don't uh don't really know there to be perfectly honest <laughs> all right let's take a look at these mounts here these are the uh turtles dragon turtles if i remember correctly very beautiful mount well designed uh, one of the best parts of the miss of pandaria is the mounts Definitely. You take a look at all these different colors here. You've got red, green, blue, uh, regular old, you know, brownish colors. Very cool. On the flip side here, you've got the Horde, Pandaren, and Orgrimma, which are selling the same mounts. This guy, Softpaws here, will give you your apprentice writing, and Turtle Master here will sell you the turtle. And they are pretty similar to the turtles, as you can see here, that were in Stormwind. If you take a look at the map, you can see that we are in the Valley of Honor, which is really close to where the orcs were uh, selling their mounts in Argamon. Speaking of orcs, this is where you can get the orc, org, orgs here. Uh, in just a moment, this is your riding trainer. He will sell you the apprentice riding for four, four gold, roughly. Uh, our friend here, where is he? There we go. Our friend here, or Gunaro Wolfrunner, as it would seem, will sell you the wargs if you are an orc or exalted with Orgrimmar. We've also got ourselves some wolves here. Uh, this is the Timber Wolf and also the Brown Wolf. We've also got ourselves a Black Wolf here. Very nice. I love the look of the Black Wolf. And finally, a Dire Wolf, uh, right over here, a Dire Riding Wolf, I like it, I like it a lot, my favorite of the Riding Wolves, and if we take a look at the map, here in just a moment, we'll see that we're still in the Valley of Honor. Here we are picking up the Raptor Mounts for the Trolls, this is in Senjin Village, uh, this is your Apprentice Trainer. And this is your raptor seller if you are a troll or exalted with the trolls, the dark spear trolls, I believe they are. You can see that they're uh, roughly about one gold, I believe. We've got ourselves a turquoise blue sort of raptor here. We've also got a 
green raptor right over here and a purple uh, reddish sort of raptor here and there's only three of them uh, let's take a look at the map here we can see that we are actually in Senjin village just south of Orgrimmar and Duratog let's take a look at where it is relative to the griffin master here we've got ourselves the Torn mounts these are Kodos perhaps my favorite of the racial mounts besides maybe the Hawk Strider. The Kodos are a big torn mount, very nice. They match the personality of the trainers here. This is the Kodo Seller. If you are a torn or exalted with the Torns, uh, Thunder Bluff, I believe. And you've got yourself um, the different variations of Kodos here. Uh, not very different between each one, only slight variations, but all of them are still very cool. Mostly saddle variations, really. Uh, and the spots. If we take a look at the uh, map here and see where we are, we're in Bloodhood Village. Open up the map here. And you actually, you can see that we're right next to the Griffin Rider. Anyways, we're in Bloodhood Village here, just south of Thunderbolt. As for the undead, you'll be having a skeletal uh, horse. Very cool. Uh, most people seem to like this one a lot, even though I think it's a pretty bare bones, <laughs> no pun intended mount. Uh, you can get your skill training and your horse here if you're an undead or exalted with um, Lord Day on the uh, Undercity here. See the different types here of the skeletal horse. Uh, mostly just uh, hues uh, and not even saddle colors. You can also see that uh, it's it's mostly just, just a cloth on it, the cloth banner that changes colors. If we take a look at the map here, we'll see that we are in uh, Tears Fall Glades, right at Brill. And here we are, just east of the entrance of Silvermoon, at the library here, that I believe it's called Thorns Library. Uh, here we've got ourselves the trainer for riding, apprentice riding, and over here we have ourselves the, the seller of the mounts. These are Hawks Riders, and you can get them if you are a Blood Elf or exalted with Silver Moon City. They're about one gold and these are just gorgeous. You gotta take a look at these. Of course the Blood Elves would have the most beautiful mount. <laughs> got purple, red, uh, blue, and a black. Uh, they're very chokeable style, which I like if you're a fan of Final, Final, Final Fantasy VII. Ooh, tongue twister there. Uh, and that's my own little uh, motorcycle mount there. You can actually see on the map here that we are just east of the entrance of Silver Moon. I'll pull it up here in a moment. Uh, just there's the entrance, and you can come down the path here to Thorn's Library. And of course, you can forget the goblins. Uh, they don't have their own home, so now they do it in Orgrimmar. <laughs> Instead of Undermine, we've got uh, the Valley of Spirits here, and that guy will train you in riding. This guy will sell you the trikes if you are a goblin or exalted with uh, the goblin faction. You can, the village water cartel if I, if I remember correctly. You have to look at the trikes. There's only one variation of them, uh, fortunately. Uh, but they're still very cool and excellent, uh, unique. You, know, you can see we're all the way down here in the corner. That's uh, where you gotta go. You just come through the door here in the Valley of Spirit and walk all the way to the back wall. And that's it for how to get your first mount on WoW at level 20 apprentice riding skill. If you like what you saw, shoot me a comment, leave me a like, or even give me a subscribe if you're feeling really generous. Hope you uh, liked what you saw, and good luck in getting your first mount. Have a good one.